Hey, it's Gorjuna. You're watching my channel Epic World. In this channel, you find more educational and informative videos like travel, history, animal, nature, and many more things. So please like and subscribe this channel, and also share this video with more your friends. Today's topic is about the Arctic wolf. Let's get started. Arctic wolves, also known as the white wolf or polar wolf, are a subspecies of gray wolves. They spend their life in the Arctic tundra higher than the northern tree line. They are the only wolf in the world with their coloring unique due to the environment where they live. Due to its isolation, this wolf is not under threat by habitat destruction and hunting as its southern relatives are, and is the only wolf subspecies that is not threatened. Distribution Arctic wolves live in the Arctic regions of Greenland and North America. They live amongst the Arctic tundra on land that is covered with ice and snow except bright fly in the summer months. They also occur in the Arctic region's glacier valleys, northern rolling hills, and ice fields by shallow lakes. Mating Habits Arctic wolves are a monogamous species and the alpha male and beta female are the only ones that are allowed to mate. Breeding takes place in winter from January to March. After a gestation of 61 to 63 days, 5 to 7 pups are born, each weighing about a pound. The newborns are brown in color and are helpless, being blind and deaf, and they depend upon the whole pack to protect them. Their eyes open in about 10 days. Their mother is very protective, not allowing other pet members into the den until the pups are 2 weeks old. Pups are weaned after about 2 months. After these early stages of development, the fathers help raise the pups by teaching them to play and hunt. Pups are strong enough at 6 months old to travel and will join the rest of the pack to learn survival skills. Males are sexually major at 1 year old and females at above the age of 2. Diet and Nutrition Arctic wolves are predatory carnivores and eat a wide variety of food, hunting in packs for musk, oxen, and caribou. They also eat Arctic hares, lemmings, termite gun, and other small animals such as nesting birds. Habits and Lifestyle Arctic wolves are a social species and live in packs, numbering 7 to 8 related animals. Within the pack, there is a very complex social order, and every member has its place in the dominance hierarchy. Each wolf knows its position through body posture communication. The pack's leader is a male, and usually only he and the dominant female mate. However, all pack members share the responsibility of looking after the pups. These animals do not hibernate, because during the winter, much of the species they prey on is especially active at this time. They are awake either during the day or at night, but are generally diurnal. Arctic wolves hunt in packs and then share the kill. A wolf has a few different means of communication. They howl for many reasons, such as signaling their location to other pack members or bringing members together for a hunt. A howl can also warn neighboring wolves to stay out from their territory. They use scent markings to communicate territorial boundaries as well as their presence to other wolves. Population Population Threats Unlike other wolf species, the Arctic wolf hardly ever comes into contact with people and is not under threat by prediction or hunting. However, industrial development is a threat. An increasing number of roads, mines, and pipelines encroaching on its territory and interrupting its food supply. Another threat to the species is climate change. Recent extreme weather variations have made finding food more difficult for Arctic hares and musk oxen to find food causing their numbers to decline significantly and therefore affecting this traditional food supply for the Arctic wolf. Population number According to the Cool Antarctica resource, the total population size of the Arctic wolf is around 200,000 individuals. Currently, this species is classified as least concern on the IUCN red list. Fun facts for kids When Arctic wolves hunt as a pack, one adult member will always remain behind as a puppy sitter. Arctic wolves travel much farther than wolves of the forest when looking for food, and they sometimes do not eat for several days. The Arctic wolf can 
cope with sub-zero temperatures as well as five months of total darkness each year. During the winter, these woods grow a second layer of fur to protect themselves against the cold. Like many other animals such as domestic dogs, early wolves have a mechanism that maintains their paws at a temperature lower than the body core, thus minimizing heat loss in them, although they are in contact with the frozen ground. Blood going into their paws, huge blood that is leaving, preventing their core from getting cooled by the loss of the heat through their feet. The feet of dogs and penguins have similar mechanisms. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you want more educational animal videos or world videos, so please make sure to subscribe our channel.